Nature, so beautiful and yet so vulnerable that it sometimes needs protection from men against nature itself. Due to the effects of climate change, many European regions are under great pressure from changing weather conditions. Either there's not enough rainfall, causing droughts or forest fires, or there's too much rainfall, causing floods. Avoiding climate change is one thing. Dealing with the results in the right way is another. That's what FACTS is all about. The FACTS project is funded by the European Regional Development Fund through the Interregional Cooperation Program Interred 4C, in which regions of Europe work together to share experiences and good practices. FACTS focuses on the risks of climate change and wants to propose a method to increase the resilience of areas to respond to and recover from extreme weather conditions. The project is based on partnerships and cooperation on two levels. The European level, with 14 partner organizations from eight different countries leading the project. And on a local level, where public and private organizations, local governments, civil organizations and citizens work closely together to face the specific challenges for their region. The cooperation between all these people and stakeholders is absolutely necessary as their combined support and action is essential for implementing integrated territorial strategies. These strategies do not focus on one specific topic, but look at all components involved. Ecological, social, economical. This integrated approach is the key to success, as the solution is often found in the reallocation of land ownerships and smarter management of the territory. FACTS is about inspiring local and regional policymakers, sharing ideas, developing best practices, and perhaps most important of all, demonstrating that solutions are possible. For this reason, FACTS initiated five pilot projects, each including a region that is vulnerable and threatened by floods, droughts, or forest fires. The first pilot project is situated in Spain, in the province of Pontevedra, Galicia. Due to climate change, the risk of forest fires increases in summer, threatening both rural and urban areas. This risk is enhanced due to the presence of a lot of biomass. In Greece, the Natura 2000 Strophilia forest is facing similar challenges combined with the pressure that human activities are exerting on the region's ecosystem as a result of economic motives or insufficient environmental awareness. Two other pilot projects are running in Portugal and Belgium, dealing with the risks of flooding. In Portugal, a higher seawater level and an increase of floods from rivers threaten the unique flora and fauna in the area of Baixo Vuga Lagunar. And in the Belgian province of Limburg, the vulnerable pond systems of the Wales are facing high risks of regular flooding and drought, influencing the life and future of many species and habitats. The variations in temperature in the region of Varna in Bulgaria can cause short-term changes in the amount of precipitation. This sometimes results in floods and droughts affecting the local economy. FACTS can be seen as a framework for all European member state policymakers, both national and regional, on how to deal with vulnerable regions under pressure of the effects of climate change. The project started in 2010 and runs until the end of 2012, 
In these three years, the 14 partner organizations follow a strict methodology and time plan based on study visits, thematic workshops, and pilot actions. All partner organizations and their experts are conscious of the complexity of their mission and the long-term perspective involved. But their passion will ensure that their ideas and solutions can be shared with many others across Europe, leading to approved regional policies and more resilient areas.